Okay, Reckle, let's see what you got for me today. I need money. I got a pen fifty to buy. The best thing is we're gonna have this update for probably like the next couple of months. So I get this. Oh, and I've been uh, I did some loadout testing with the M50. It will not accept gimbals. So your best to stick with the size two weapons. Hang on. Let's see what she's got. Yes. Hey, I was hoping you'd swing round again. I love the NPC interactions. Just walk up to them and turn around. Ah, it's like... then you'll be wanting to see me. Name's Reco. I see to the boring, fiddly bits for most of the miners work in the area. Yes, I know. Dig site claims, equipment orders, or transfers and the like. For most jobs, the terminal will set you up. But if you're after something with a bit of hair on it, best to talk to me direct. I guess her, she like, got reset for the update. Now. Nothing too big, but it'll let us see how we feel about working together. Sound all right to you? Sounds good. Great. I'll take a scan through now. Oh, yeah, so, yeah, uh, the best thing to do would be with the, go with the Scorpions. But I was thinking about the Cutlass. What if I, I took the repeaters off of and put uh, two more Scorpions on it? So I'm firing four Gatling guns. Put two more Gatling guns on the turret. You could do some serious damage with that thing. Uploading the contract to you now. All right, let's see what I gotta do. <laughs> of course. Kudra Dolevsky. Sounds good. Fly safe. Fly safe, yes. That way I don't end up with a leg like yours. I am holding drugs again. Really? Hey, look, it's a pack. Oh, it's a pack of pink pills. I'm hauling a pack of pink pills. So you've they up have ha <laughs> you've upgraded <laughs> from the widow, huh? <laughs> oh boy. They've got happy faces on them. Oh. You, know, you would think that you would think customs would have something to say about this, you know pack of fucking obviously illicit stuff that I'm talking about as I walk past they're generic M&Ms don't you know they just couldn't <laughs> they just couldn't afford the M so they had to use a colon and a colon and a bracket uh, the uh, a custom kind of that's where I'm going all right off to Damar uh, what should I take uh, probably take Cutlass. Oh boy, I'm probably going to Jump Town. Stash House on Yella. Oh, be careful. I'm warning you. There uh, are yeah. there's there's a lot of people camping the Jump Town out on every server right now. It's unbelievable. There's uh, Black Vein Inc. And then there was another one. And I can't remember what they are, but there's literally people camping out there and hammerheads and stuff like that. Taking anybody down. <laughs> you so what you're saying is I should take something that's stealthy. Stealthy, and, uh, fast, and has got some good yeah, shields I'm on set. it. Like, even and fast. Then, <laughs> and then uh, take shelter inside the uh, the thing. Or, uh, no, never mind. If it comes down to it, I might even have to come out there and rescue you. Oh no, because one, you gotta realize though, once you get there and drop it off, you get paid for it, so... Just take something you don't really care about, really. Yep. Abuse that insurance, huh? No, that's not abuse of insurance. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, take, uh... Get in your non-existent money's worth. That's what, that's what you should call it. Using it while we can. Oh, so here's something that was funny. Uh, before the up, uh, before 3.4, I decided to take the the M50 out the Lorville, right? <laughs> I was getting into the hangar. I hit the auto light and I exploded. I don't know how that happened.
But yeah, apparently Jump Town's been like major campsite, like major, major. Every server I've been on, every chat, people are like, <laughs> like guy jumped out, are you gonna kill me? No, you're good. Go there. Oh, you, I've done it. Where's my ship? You know, it's just like, and then there's one guy. What's his name? Uh, Dogtown. Did you ever see him in chat? Something wrong with him. He's definitely been using too much Widow. And keeps yelling in chat. Uh, the drug lab is open. The drug lab is closed. A cold night. A cold night spawns on Yella. That kind of stuff. It's like... Serious. <laughs> serious issues, man. Alright. I wish the hangars were connected to each other via, like, a tunnel. So you could go from one to another. Oh, shh. No. I forgot to adjust my sensitivity. Because I actually deleted my user folder this time. Yeah, me too. I never do. This is the first time I did it, so I gotta... Gotta change all my... Adjust, adjust my settings here. Off we go. Alright, so I am going to... It dropped my drugs. Really? What the hell? Oh, he's gonna kill me. I lost his product. It looks like I can actually jump to you now. Because I see you as a, a beacon on the star map. Head off to Daymar. Wow, the spooling takes longer. Oh my god. One pays almost five grand, so it's actually pretty good. It's just a simple delivery mission. But I'm curious to see what you get after that. Right, like this is just basically the, the starter mission. Interesting how the cooldown from Delamar to Damar is the same as from Hurston to Crusader. Wait, spool. There we go. Quantum drive is now on. Yeah, spooling takes forever. They nerfed the big guy. I've noticed the doors seem to be working better this time around too. They seem to be opening when you walk up to them and uh, they don't have that glitch where you gotta hit them and then they immediately close and then reopen. Oh, I haven't, like I said, I haven't seen much in 3.4. I was on this morning just to do that quick mission. Let's check it out. Well, I haven't done anything. What I'm wondering is if they fixed the uh, the one with the prospect, where I've noticed a few door issues on that thing. But, yeah, if you walk up to a door and it doesn't open, like an auto door, 
It's usually because there's an NPC standing on the other side. Absolutely pisses me off. You open the door, there's like three of them standing there, and they're actually blocking the motion sensor. Whoa, spin out. I was in Lorville uh, the other day there, over by where the hangar elevators are, and there's like every guard in the area was sitting, like shooting each other in a circle. <laughs> Just like constantly shooting each other. Unbelievable. I was waiting to see if they would actually kill, kill each other, but those guys are tough. I've been to Kudra. Oh, yeah, I'm going to Kudra. That's m where I'm going. You're picking up too? Yeah. 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 It wasn't as easy as the other one. That was beautiful. I had to go down somewhere where there was a. There was another guy. It looked like he was another mission giver or something. Really seedy looking thing. Looking guy. I don't know if it's me, but it seems to look better around here. I haven't been to Daymar in a while. Landing gear down. I'm actually going inside. Now we don't have to run around. I can see the gravity's been nerfed here. Engines offline. I just, I just tap control a little bit. I'm like a hundred meters off the ground. It slams me like a rock, like the Conan used to do. Oh, my pie's done. I'll be back. Okay. Okay, let's go pick up this package. Oh man, this movie gear card's amazing. Okay, go inside. box will give me a package. Uh, thank you. Right. Now back to let's do That's quite the lighting. I like missed every rock except for that one. Welcome 
And away yeah. we go. So how are you liking your Freelancer Max? You got one of those, right? No, no, I'm waiting for the Taurus. Oh, the Taurus. Yeah, I think that was uh, 3.6. What did they, uh, what are they loaning for it now? Still a uh, uh, Freelancer? No, no, Andromeda and a Hornet. Oh. The last time I took the, uh, the Connie out in the pad, I got blown up with all my cargo in it. So now when I need money, I just take the miner out. But the, mis the missions pay, that's what I mean. Like it's, it's actually something different to do, easy money to make. new number there now on the on the jump points phone call why is it not letting me jump to Delamar Yeah, all the packets of drugs that I was picking up from Duke, they kept, like, disappearing. Like, that last one disappeared in my hand. The other ones, I would set them on the floor in a cargo area, and they would stay there, like, for a second, and then I'd fly to wherever, and then I'd go back to where they I set them down on the floor, and they were gone. Here's something so. you can try, because I've seen on the package there's more than just one option. Have tried stowing them. Ah. Uh, because when you're holding them in your hand, you can probably still use the inner thaw, right? Try stowing yeah, it. Yeah. Try stowing yeah, it. Yeah, I up. tried just set down, and it would. It showed green, so I was like, "Oh, okay, it, it, it'll. It's a valid location, you know." Uh, yeah. Oh. They could be despawning, so you could try either stowing or you could check in your inventory. They could be ended up in there. That's possible. Quantum drive is now on. It's hard to say, I don't know, I stay away from the drugs. Yeah, that's the good working hard uh, hard working good boy. Quantum drive is now when I want to be. You know it would be nice if that interceptor actually had like one spot for a, a single cargo box like what these delivery missions are. Be so yeah. <laughs> it'd be so fun like, just rip it around like that open up a random panel on there there really should be a random panel on every ship that allows you to place boxes like yeah. that. Yeah, just one box is all you really need. 
Like, I think the Mustang finally does have that now, doesn't it? It did it before. I have no idea. I don't... Well, the Mustang does cargo section does open up. Yeah, I don't think it did before. I think that was... It does not. Or what? it used to not, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, again, I think that's why I went with the Aurora when I first got in. Even though I didn't really like this yet, I personally, I think it's an ugly piece of crap. But don't get me wrong, that, that ship did help me out in the beginning. It had cargo, it had, did have space in the back, I think. Actually, no, it didn't. Did it? Just had the bed. Yeah, it had the bed. And the, the little spot for somebody to stand behind you. That's Yeah, well, that was actually the, the, the box drop-off area. What it was, that's what the trick was. You got in, you lowered the landing gear, had the door open. If you stood there, you could actually drop the box inside. But that was before I knew about the actual place option. Oh, I'm not close enough, what? Uh, probably down at the bottom of the list. Of course you are. Hello, Eslin. Oh, you're back at Levski already. Yes, I am. Now I want to. I want to see what happens. Am I gonna get another contract from right away, or do I have to wait, or can I ask for one, or how it works? Because if the starter one pays four and a half grand, she's gonna offer something that's like ten or fifteen. If we're doing like a Hurston run or something. Kudra, my second home. Uh, like I said, I haven't been at Kudra in a long time. Oh, they added landing pads to Kudra. They're, those weren't there a sec, like, earlier today, before I started, or yesterday, whatever, last time I played. Where were they? Because I was just there at Kudra, and I did not see them there. Uh, oh, it might not be Kudra then. It might have just said it was Kudra. Uh, it's probably Arc Corp or actually, something. Actually, no, I don't think I was at Kudra because I didn't... Like, Kudra's got the huge field of miners out front, right? And I always... Uh, oh. Yeah, more or less. Yeah, and I think I only saw, like, two two or four. Maybe it sent me to, uh, like, Bountiful or something. Oh, Bountiful is where I'm thinking. Well, I'll find out here in a second. I'll look at the map and see where I am. Oh, because I know Kudra's got like, or no, no, it's mining area one, one, the, one of the mining areas that have all the miners out front. Because I was looking at them, but it told me Kudra. But whatever, as long as you're going to the marker, that's all. The only thing that matters. We gotta get like utility carts to carry these op boxes easier. Ah, oh, these elevators so slow. Somebody's got a, uh, uh, Aquila. Maybe it's Captain. Uh, he's not playing right now. Ah. Oh. oh, yeah. What a week. I tell you, it's been six days of absolute goddamn hell. The days were getting longer and longer and longer and longer and uh, yesterday was even worse because we, we have a, a train system here. It's like 
sort of like a subway, but it's more like the one in Chicago instead, like uh, elevated. But uh, we had a bit of a windstorm here, and there was a lot of debris thrown on the tracks. And the trains got all backed up, and for some reason, when one train stops, it's not like the whole system stops. It just all backs up and they start backing up so everything has to get rolling again. I'm thinking, well, why don't the trains just wait at the station if they don't move? So it took like two and a half, three hours for the trains to actually start getting on their proper routine. And it's like, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, there we go. That was an easy four and a half grand. Done and done. Sweet. Plus the usual stuff that I have to deal with at work, which drives me absolutely nuts. <sighs> and then today was no better. It's supposed to be a half day. I didn't get out of there till after seven hours. I'm running around busting my ass. And, you know, so swamped with work. But it was all worth it. Because in the next two and a half weeks, I only have to work five days. So I will not complain about that. I'm off for five, and I work two, and I'm off for another four. Nice. Oh, yes. Very nice. I had the option to actually work on, mon on Monday, this coming Monday, but uh, I just basically take the day off and not get paid for it if I don't want to work. So I'm not actually technically getting paid for it, but fuck it, I don't care. Yeah, I uh, mine's just the normal schedule that I work, but I work uh, Monday night through Thursday night next week, and then I get uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday off. Then I work Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday.